What's up, y'all? Kilo Nels here. Now, I'm going to show y'all how do I fix my broken bench press. Is your bench press broken? Don't worry. I'm going to fix it right now. Follow me. All right, y'all. Step one, set yourself up for success. Make sure the rack height is correct, the bar is in the right placement, and you're putting the weights on correctly. That's step one. Safety first. Now, step number two is hand placement on the bar. Where do we grab the bar? Okay, when you go to the bar, you're gonna see there's rings on there. Now these rings are put here to make sure your hands are put evenly on both ends of the bar. If your middle finger is on the ring on the right, do the same thing on the left. If you do it on the pointer finger on the right, do the same thing on the left and vice versa. So by keeping the hands even, the bar is gonna be even on the descent and ascending. Coming down and going up on your bench press, the bar will be perfectly balanced as long as your hands are perfectly balanced. Your feet must be balanced with your hands also. So the same width as your feet are, make sure your hands are the exact same way as if it's a mirror with your hands and your feet from the bottom all the way to the top. Step number three is going to be leg drive. Now, leg drive can be done in two different ways. Some people drive through their toes and they're super efficient by doing it this way, by getting the leg drive through their toes. But other people, like myself, I like it when my feet are flat and I can drive through the heels as if I'm doing a squat. I get a lot more power out of my bench press when I'm driving through my heels and my feet are flat. But like I said earlier, this is all preference. Some people like driving through their toes, some like when they're flat-footed. Now the final step is having your chest meet the bar. When your chest is meeting the bar, you're pulling your shoulders back and this is taking the pressure off your shoulders and activating the chest, the lats, and those triceps to finish off that movement. All right, y'all. Now make sure you implement all those steps and keep working to build your bench press up. It won't happen overnight, all right? If you keep implementing and pushing these steps and day after day after day, it's going to get better, all right? Be patient, lock in, and let's get this work done, all right? Kilo Nails signing out. And comment below and let me know how great your bench press goes after putting these steps into your program, all right? Kilo Nails signing out.